feature message broadcaster click on open to get started if you want to send a message by manually entering numbers you can use the manual entry feature here you can select your country code and manually enter the phone numbers from here you can attach any media file here you can enter your message and set a time gap interval in seconds if you want to send messages using an excel or other spreadsheet file you can use this feature simply drag and drop or select your excel or odds file to continue now let's demonstrate a live example using google sheets copy the url of the google sheet you want to use for sending bulk messages now paste the copied url here and click next a browser pop up will appear downloading your google sheet simply drag and drop the file like this to continue the process now select the sheet and rows then click next here you can select the country code and phone number column you can choose a message from your sheet or use the right message feature where you can insert pre-saved templates and sheet variables to fully customize your message you can set the time gap interval in seconds once done click send to start message broadcasting Once the message broadcasting is complete, you can download the broadcast report for reference. Now, now, let's learn how to review your data sheet before sending bulk messages to ensure your broadcasts are error-free and complete. Now, let's look at the first case. If your phone number column already contains complete numbers with country codes, like in data case 1, you don't need to select a separate country code. Simply click on the country code field and choose the option. I don't want the country code. Then, in the phone number field, select your phone number column. For the message field, either select the column with your message or click the write message button to type a custom one. Now, let's look at the second case. If your sheet has a separate column for country codes and another for phone numbers without country codes, like in data case 2, no need to worry. Just click on the country code field, select select from sheet column and choose your country code column. Then, select the phone number column under the phone number field and choose your message column in the Your Message field. Now, let's look at the third case. If your sheet contains local phone numbers without country codes, but all numbers are from the same country, simply select that country's code from the country code field. Then, choose your phone number column under the phone number field and your message column under the Your Message field. Thanks for watching. If you have any questions, feel free to reach out to us.